More than 50 Amazon workers have been left ill after a can of bear repellent exploded in their New Jersey warehouse. At least 24 people have been rushed to hospital after experiencing difficulty breathing and burning in their eyes and throat. One of those taken to hospital was taken to the intensive care unit and had to be intubated, according to NBC. Co.UK wants 2018 12 ambulances and a medic rushed to the scene in Robbins Villa 11 1544034341326. Dailymail.co.uk once 2018 12516107049588643843 image of 51544028590366.jpg height equals 350 width equals 634 alt equals class equals book border img share copy link to page in your message Robert Wood Johnson Hospital confirmed to the network it was treating nine patients. The bear repellent is reported to have fallen from a shelf in the giant building in Robbinsville Township at around 8.50 a.m. this morning. Robbinsville Fire Department said that seven ambulances and a medic responded to the incident to treat multiple patients. Emergency crews are said to have set up a triage unit outside the warehouse to treat patients. Bear repellent usually contains high doses of pepper spray and Amazon sells maximum strength and range versions. Dailymail.co.uk once 2018 12 The Robbinsville Fire Department tweeted that they were on the S2 1544034341326. Dailymail.co.uk once 2018 12 5 16 7 million 50 thousand 288 6 million 463 thousand 843 image of 7 1 trillion 544 billion 28 million 622 thousand 871 dot jpg height equals 423 width equals 634 alt equals class equals book border img share copy link to paste in your message share this article share an Amazon spokesperson told Business Insider today at our Robbinsville Fulfillment Center, a damaged aerosol can dispensed strong fumes in a contained area of the facility. The safety of our employees is our top priority, and as such, all employees in that area have been relocated to safe place, and employees experiencing symptoms are being treated on-site. As a precaution, some employees have been transported to local hospitals for evaluation and treatment. We appreciate the swift response of our local responders 